everybody and welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be another planner haul I have some sticker hits here for you guys and I also have a washi order from the pink room co I will save the washi for last but let's go ahead and I will start off with some sticker kits so the first order I have here is from Planner Gems. I picked up three kits and a couple of other little fun stickers here. So let me go ahead and just zoom you guys in to these little bad boys here. So this is the Planner Gems uh, business card here. Um, it says, thank you for your order, happy planning. And it has like all of her uh, social media on here. I did pick this up off of the Planner Gems um, Etsy shop. So here's a little freebie that she put in for me. I think this will actually match uh, one of the kits that I ordered. This is on like glossy paper. So you have some like washi strips here, some flags and quarter boxes. And these are just so adorable. I really, really love this. So then the first thing I ordered here are these little small like flags. I got two different colorways here. The first one is uh, like this really cool kind of like rainbow, uh, uh, like gemstone colorway here. So I definitely had to pick that one up. If it comes in a rainbow, I'm gonna pick it up. This one has a whole bunch of little matching pairs and it's in like a multi colorway. So you have yellows and blues, some neutrals here, some brighter colors, um, and even some black ones. And these again, all have that kind of gem, like shattered gem design to it. The next thing that I picked up were these date covers. And I just thought they were very, very unique. I kind of like how they have like that, I don't know, like a ticket stub type of like frame to it um, and it has like a copper a silver a gold and kind of like a like a black and then this has like a uh, marbled background so definitely had to pick this up because again pretty unique I don't quite have date covers like this in my collection and I do think it can match a few kits um, and this is in the matte paper and then these are on glossy paper these are actually very similar colorway except these are like the glitter ones on glossy paper then I got the kind of like gem ones on glossy paper as well. I'm gonna have to kind of angle this for you guys so that you won't get uh, that glare off of the glossy paper. So this first kit is called School Life. So I think this is for the vertical kit, not the horizontal kit. So these are the full boxes and you have some quarter boxes down here. I really love this artwork. I've actually picked up another kit from Sophie Rose Paper with this artwork on it but like I mentioned in my previous haul this artwork does have a lot of blues and pinks in it the one from Sophie Rose paper has like a splash of green to it so I still pick this up because I am a full-time student and I'm also going to be uh, teaching full-time so these back to school kits are always going to have a place in you know my sticker collection so I definitely wanted to pick up anything that's back to school related and that also has has uh, bows on it. So you again, here are your full boxes. You have some icons here, some deco and your checklists. This is your bottom washi. Then you have your washi strips here. This is absolutely gorgeous, you guys. Uh, you have more deco, some quarter boxes. These are your date dots and then your date covers here. You have some half boxes and um, some weekly habit trackers here, some build do uh, stickers. These are your ombre heart checklist and these do have like a glitter type background. Your headers and your littles. Next I picked up the dream maker kit because this is a uh, Tiffany or a, a, a breakfast at Tiffany's inspired kit and I just, I, first of all I love that movie and then second of all I love that like Tiffany blue design this is very girly um, I love the bows on here I just really liked the enjoyed the artwork on here so again these are your full boxes your icons and your checklist with some deco on here your bottom washi and washi strips some more deco your date dots and your date covers I love her little kind of 
like squoval date dots. Then you have your half boxes, some habit trackers, your ombre heart checklist. This has like a floral background to it. And then your headers and your littles. And then the last kit I have here is the dream kit. So here are your full boxes. And I really love that little unicorn there. Your icons, checklist, weekend banner, and some deco. Your bottom washi. I love this. I love this like... Arabic looking um, like building background here, some washi strips, your quarter boxes, some deco, date dots and date covers, half boxes and habit trackers, your ombre heart checklist and this has a glitter background to it. And then the last one are your headers and your littles. All right, next I have an order here from Station Stickers. I picked up two kits from her and I have been wanting to try uh, Station Stickers for a while, but they're always sold out. Her kits are so popular and every time I try to go and pick up a kit, everything is just sold out. So I'm glad I was able to um, pick up these kits because these kits are definitely my type of kit. I love foiled kits. First thing here, I have this little ombre heart checklist. Um, it says uh, we made a mistake, so here's an extra. I haven't seen any mistakes, so this may have just been a little freebie that they added in, but I picked up the Robin kit and this is like a Winnie the Pooh inspired kit. I think the artwork is so so cute on here. So this is the first page here and it has um, your foiled deco on here in two different um, colorways. So I think that's absolutely gorgeous. Here are your full boxes and then here is like a strip of washi and I love the way she foils her kits. So it's like a splash of foil on these kits. It's just so so beautiful. I love it. And the Winnie the Pooh characters are so cute. They're kind of like the baby Winnie the Pooh characters. I love the pastel colors on this kit as well. This uh, another washi strip here, your ombre heart checklist, but just the washi strip is foiled on this page. These are your glitter headers and your half boxes, your headers and um, quarter boxes, some deco and your weekend uh, banner there and a movie marquee some littles, your date covers and date dots. I love this colorway, you guys. And then this last page is your bottom washi, which is also foiled. And then you have your washi strips and your little deco here. This deco is just so cute, you guys. I'm loving this kit. And like I said, I've been trying to get some type of station stickers kit for a while now because I love the way she just does this like splash of foil all over her kits. So this next one is in Pasley Paisley. Paisley, I think. Yeah, I think this is a typo, typo here. Because it says Paisley here, but then it says Passily on um, these next kits. Maybe that that was the oops. I don't know. But this is the Paisley kit. And these are your foiled um, deco. I'm sorry. These are your foiled icons in two different colorways to match the kit. Here is uh, your full boxes. And again, this is also foiled. It has kind of like that sprinkle or splash of foil all over the boxes. I love that. That's like my favorite way to foil something. This uh, top little washi strip here is also foiled. Your ombre heart checklist, glitter headers, half boxes, and some habit trackers here. Some headers, I really love the font of these headers as well. Some quarter boxes, your weekend banner, and more deco. Some littles, some date covers, and date dots. And then this last page, again, is foiled. That bottom washi is foiled. You have your deco and your washi strips. Alrighty, my next order is from Rose Colored Days. She was recently having a sale, so I went a little crazy and I picked up a lot of like headers and a lot of her overlays. So the first thing that I picked up are these hollow headers. If it comes in hollow, I'm pretty much going to pick it up. Maybe you guys will be able to see that, but they are on like transparent paper here. So these are actually um, overlay headers. 
So I picked up two of each. I have two of the glitter uh, hollow headers. I have two of the shallow shattered glass ones. And then I have two of the like star version. All right, so let's go ahead and start off. Um, I should have shown this first. This is uh, her business card and it's foiled. Um, oh, this is really, really pretty. I'm, I'm gonna have to keep this and use this for something because I think that's absolutely gorgeous. She also threw in this beautiful journaling card that says um, bloom in foil here. So this is the little foiled um, freebie that I got. You have some days off, some icons here. Um, a really, really cute freebie. I think I'll definitely get some use out of that. I'm gonna go ahead and get started um, with these date dots. I ordered uh, some just plain black date dots on transparent paper. So I got two sheets of those. I also got uh, two of the silver holographic, two of the gold hollow, two uh, in the rose gold two in the regular gold and then two in uh, silver. So I went ahead and picked up these date cover date dots because I have a lot of date covers, um, but I wanted some foiled uh, date dots and I also wanted some, um, you know, just plain black ant clear date dots. I also picked up these transparent confetti uh, foiled overlays. So these are on like clear paper. So you can layer these over um, any header just to give it a little bit of sparkle. And of course I picked it up in several different uh, foiled like colorways. So this one is the gold holographic. I picked up two of those or the silver holographic. <clears throat> excuse me, the silver holographic. This one is the gold holographic. Then I have the gold, the silver, and two rose gold. So that's everything that I picked up from Rose Colored Days. And then I picked up a massive, I mean massive order from Inky and the Brain. She is a new shop to me. I just, I love her designs. I love the way she kind of puts everything together. I also follow her on um, YouTube, her YouTube channels. I'm gonna zoom you guys out a little bit, but she did send me this really pretty little card that says, thank you so much. And there's a nice little handwritten note in here. I love when companies do that and they add like a little personal touch. This is a little freebie that came in the order. So there's a 10% off coupon here. Of course, I will leave that link down below in the description box. I picked up two of these. These are her little like bow paper clips and this is all on like premium matte paper. I just loved it. So I went ahead and picked up two of those because I'm absolutely obsessed with bows and I think I could use these pretty much anywhere, any spread and I like that there's different colorways. So let me go through these before I go through the kits. This is her set of scalloped quarter boxes and I thought this was an amazing deal because you get this pastel colorway, this like primary colors, you have some more uh, darker colorways and then a neutral colorways. You get all four of these for $15. So that makes these less than like $4 a sheet. It's like three something a sheet. I love it when they do like bundles like this where you can just kind of pick everything up at once. I think you can purchase these um, separately but I'm not entirely sure. But I use these all the time in my spreads. So I went ahead and picked up two sets of that. So I think I am good on scalloped quarter boxes. I love this. This is on premium map paper. Paper. You get three of each color. You know, I think these are going to last me a pretty long time. Okay, so then I picked up a whole bunch of her kits. I'm talking about like a really thick pack of her kits because again, I love her designs and I like the fact that she has so many different options. So I picked up the mid kit. I'd say more than a mini kit because these come with um, date covers, which most mini kits don't come with date covers, but the mid kit only comes with uh, the four pages. She also has like a, like a two page mini kit option and you can purchase all of these um, a la carte. 
start. Okay, so this first kit is her Kind, Fierce, Brave kit. So here are your full boxes. I just, I love these. I love the little uh, lanterns here. And then your second page are your half boxes, your checklist, and you get enough to do the full week. Habit trackers, a weekend banner. These are your deco and your date covers. You get a movie marquee, some scripted deco there. You have your date dots. And then the last sheet is your bottom washi, your icons, and then your washi strips. I feel that with all that comes in the mid kit, I feel like I can definitely do both my Erin Condren and my smaller planner that I have for um, YouTube and social media. The next kit I have here, this is the Stand Tall Kit, and here are the full boxes. And I'm just gonna flip through these really quickly because honestly, I have so many kits that this would just take forever. So full boxes and checklists, date covers, date dots, and deco, and then your bottom washi. This is the two magical kit. So here are your full boxes, half box and checklists, date covers and date dots with your deco, and then your icons and your bottom washi. This one is called Peach Please, and I just, I loved all the peaches on here. I really do love this like peachy design. So again, here are your full boxes, your half boxes, checklist, and weekend banner date covers and your deco. I just, I'm loving all the peaches in here, you guys. And then um, your bottom washi and your flags. And then this one does come with an additional like date dots on the side. This is actually one of the kits that drew me in to this shop in the first place. This is called the Full Force. It is a Star Wars themed weekly kit. I love it. I'm just, I'm loving, loving the like color theme of this spread. It's just really, really cool spread. So your half boxes, your checklist and your weekend banner, your deco, date cover and date dots, and then your bottom washi. And I love these washi strips. You can actually use them as full boxes. This one is called seashells and here are your full boxes. Half boxes, checklist, weekend banner, your deco, date covers, and date dots, icons, and bottom washi. This one is called Brighter Days, and it's kind of like a planner girl or maybe like a back to school like related kit. Again, I just love um, the color scheme that she used with all the uh, pastel colors. Here are your half boxes, your checklist, and your weekend banner. Your deco, I'm loving these pastel date covers, and then your date dots, and then your bottom washi. This is just so gorgeous. This next kit is called Bloom, and here are your full boxes. I love the little like the plaid design kind of mixing with the floral. So your half boxes, your checklist, and your weekend banner. Your deco, I love this plaid design. These are your date covers and then your date dots and your bottom washi and washi strips. This next one is called Coffee Love and I have several like coffee kits, but what I really liked about this is kind of how it has like these coffee water stains. I love using like coffee to stain paper to kind of give it that like old effect. So I don't know, I just thought this was a really like unique twist on that kind of stained paper, coffee stained paper uh, concept. I really, really love that box with all the different like uh you know coffee rings and all the different like staining patterns so here are your full boxes your half boxes checklist and weekend banner your deco date covers and date dots and then i love this bottom washer like i said these are like the coffee stains um like the bottom of the cup when it's when it stains or when it leaves a ring on the table love it this is another cute kit called squeeze the day i like the pastel colors in here like it's summery but you can also use this for springtime so here are your full boxes half boxes your checklist and your weekend banner your deco, I'm loving like the mix with these like palm leaves. These are your date covers and your date dots. 
And then your bottom washi. I just, I love those like little pastel uh, citrus uh, rings there. The next kit is called Seek the Sea. And I'm just loving the pastel colors here. I think she does pastel colors really well, but she also does bold colors really well, as you guys will see in a few upcoming kits. So again, here are your full boxes, your half boxes, checklist, and weekend banner deco date covers and you have your labels here when she does these like labels and quarter boxes she does include um the date dots uh separately and then your bottom washi icons and washi strips so this one is called ocean child and here are your full boxes half boxes checklist weekend banner i just i really like her weekend banners her deco date covers and date dots and then her bottom washi and washi strips. I just really like this artwork. I really liked her interpretation of that artwork. So this next kit is called Summer State of Mind. And I just I love the little flip flops here. So you have your full boxes. It's like flip flops, polka dots, watermelons, pineapples, very summery themed. Your half boxes checklist and weekend banner. That weekend banner is so cute with all those little watermelons in it your deco date covers and again if she includes flags then she has the date dots on a separate page and then your bottom washi and washi strips this is such a cute kit okay so this next kit is a harry potter themed kit and this one is called charms and i'm sure you guys have seen this clip art i guess and a lot of different kits but i liked the pastel format of it so when i saw that she had this like pastel version of the kit and I really, really like her, her mid kit. I think she also does pastels really nicely. So, you know, it was a win-win situation for me. So here are your full boxes and then your half boxes, checklist and weekend banner. That weekend banner is just stunning, you guys. Uh, your deco, your date covers and date dots and your bottom washi with your icons and your washi strips. I think this kit was just perfect for me. She did such a great job um, with that kit. So then this one is called Pumpkin Spice. And of course I had to pick this up. I'm a huge pumpkin, pumpkin pie, pumpkin spice latte fan. Yes, I am one of those girls. So again, she does both pastels really nicely and these bold colors beautifully. I think this is one of her like newer kits, maybe, I'm not sure. But I'm definitely gonna be picking up more of her fall kits um, when she releases them. So again, here are your full boxes your half boxes, your checklist, your weekend banner, date covers. Every time again, she has those labels. She does include her date dots separately. And then the last page is the bottom washi and then washi strips. I can't emphasize how much these kits are just perfect for me. And then the last kit I have from her is called Fiesta. And I just loved the like vibrant colors in this kit. You have like your little yamas here, your margarita glasses here. I love margaritas. Half boxes checklist that weekend banner is just so beautiful and colorful. Uh, deco, your date covers again, just very vibrant very beautiful date dots and then your bottom washi is a whole bunch of cacti washi strips feel like a broken record saying how much i absolutely love all her kits Alrighty, and then let's go ahead and finish off of this haul with a little washi haul. This is from the Pink Room Co. I had been wanting to just tear into uh, this packaging, but I wanted to show you guys like how beautiful this is packaged. So, you know, it has a little thank you card here. I just, I've seen so many people like unbox her like packages and she just does such a beautiful job just wrapping everything, so. I had to show this on camera. So I have two little packages here. I'm just gonna go one at a time. I believe these are all washi if I am not mistaken. I picked up a lot of washi from her guys. So here is your order. You do have to like open this up in order to take out all her little freebies. But let me go ahead and start off with the freebies before I show you guys all the washi. So this is the little freebie she throws in. She has her little card here 
here that says the Pink Room Co. And I, I guess you collect 10 of these um, and you get like a $15 shop credit, which I think is cool. This one here is a little freebie. And then this big boy here is her freebie on glossy paper. And she also has um, kits. I actually get the monthly kit from her. And this is the little sticker reward that you um, collect. So you would collect 10 of these um, to get, you know, your $15 shop credit. I think that's a great freebie. And then I was really excited to get this because I actually don't have that many like paperclip type of items like this. Um, so I'm definitely going to be putting this into my planner and using it immediately okay so i'm gonna zoom you guys in real quick i picked up six different sets here of washi um these all do come in sets i'm not sure if you can purchase these separately so the first one i picked up was charming in teal so i think this one right here is uh the charming washi i also picked up a charming in pink and this is the one that uh changes to the pink design so let me show you guys charming in pink this is charming in pink pink and it also has gold foiling. So I think it's a little bit more on the peachy side. Um, and then the design also kind of changes a little bit between the pink and the teal set. This is the design on the pink set and then this is the design on the teal set. The next one is the Everlasting Washi Collection and this is so beautiful. So let me start with the bottom one. It has a whole bunch of florals with some gold foiling on a white back Background. The middle one is a pink one with some, I guess, like uh, vines or little leaf designs. And then every so often you get that cute little heart with uh, some gold foiling. And then the last one is a skinny one. It's a skinny white washi with some gold foiling. You have some little heart designs there. Really, really cute little set. Again, this was the Everlasting Washi Tape Collection. The next one is called Lace of Venus. And first of all, I love lace designs. Uh, the two lace designs, you have a bigger roll and a smaller roll. These are both both in a gold foiling here. You get this really, really thin washi with a whole bunch of gold foiled, gold foiled bows, and then they are on a teal background. The next one I picked up was Daisy in Blue. There was also like Daisy in Pink and Daisy in White. I decided to go with the Daisy in Blue because I wanted the blue flower or the flowers to be on the blue washi and then the lace to be on the light pink and the white washi. So this is the daisy design on the blue washi. And then here are your lace designs, both on pink and white washi. And then the last one I have here is called Endless Summer. And there are like two bow designs in this collection. I just, I don't know, I really liked this kind of neutral color scheme. So the first one is some like palm trees, I guess, with some gold kind of like diamond little accents throughout it. I think it's really, really cute. Then you have this kind of... I don't even know what color to call it. It's like a mossy green background with gold uh, palm leaves. Then you have this nude background with some script. Something about palm trees, ocean something, endless summer, take me there. And then you have your little bow accents. Then you have the same background color except with pineapples. And then the last one is this light pink with the bows. I really like this little bow design. So that's it, you guys. That's everything that I picked up from, you know, Etsy sticker shops and the Pink Room Co. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Please give it a thumbs up if you do. Hopefully I'll see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe. I currently post three times a week on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And on Sundays and every other Sundays, I'd like to do a weekly makeup basket. So hopefully, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.